1942, the U.S. Mint was instructed to discontinue the use of any sort of copper and nickel in their coinage. This was all in an effort to conserve for the war effort. They needed the copper and nickel for munitions. So 1942, they went with a, uh, a different type of alloy and they experimented with a couple different types. So it went from a bronze that you see here into what we know as the steely or zinc-coated steel scent in 1943. But you bet you guys didn't know they also experimented with other different types of material, including this compressed phenol, which is a type of plastic that was supplied by Durez Chemical. And uh, if you were able to find one of these, and uh, they've been known to pop up for very cheap in token bins, for a buck or two, they're worth a lot of money, $2,500 on the low end. 